If I were to ask you to describe what you do, your business, your service, your product in three words, what would the words be? Hi, Mike Blissett here. Welcome to Design Your Life. Live with passion, purpose, and prosperity. And you see, there are my three words. What I'm asking you today, what three words best describe what it is that you bring to the table. I'm, I'm talking about core identity. Yes, yeah, sure, I think we, we should have a mission statement and we should have descriptions and marketing plans and business plans and all these things are, I think, have their place and are vitally important to build a successful business, whether that is a, a coaching practice, whether it's a, a speaking business, a, a training company, whatever it is that you are working, whether you're an entrepreneur, a business owner, whatever it is, I think all those kind of uh, um, identity uh, and foundations are really really important for any uh, business wanting to grow, uh, I guess with the strong foundations. But I think if you bring it all the way down to the uh, what I call core essence, it's these three words. The three words, if, if somebody asked you what it is you do in three words. For example, my, my, myself, I, I've been having this word um, that I've been writing on flip charts and uh, had a, um, a vision board app on my, on my iPhone for about the last two years and uh, on files and, and uh, on, on post-it notes and things. This word, passion, I've just been writing down forever for the last oh, certainly two, three years and, and I didn't know particularly why this word was resonating with me or, or, or what it was um, kind of trying to tell me because when I train with people and when I speak to groups etc I, I sometimes you know touch on on uh, 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 this thing uh, that I describe as uh, um, living your, living in your flow and living in your flow I'm sure you you kind of have an understanding of of what that is for me it's uh it's basically doing the thing that you are always meant to be doing at least at this point in your life i know as we grow as we mature as we get older those things can change and i think being in flow is being aware and noticing and being honorable to that so it's doing what you were really meant to be doing that's what i meant by flow and i think living in your your flow is is when you're living your passion and that's kind of what has, uh, I guess, resonated for me. And so, anyway, this word has been kind of circling around my universe for probably the last two or three years. And then the last few months working with my coach uh, uh, and my mentor, Brendan, uh, I, I, we've been working with this word just to see, um, is it just a word I like or does it actually mean something? Is it something like a, a core identity, something that's running all the, way, all the way through the middle, a bit like a stick of rock, a candy bar at a, uh, a seaside resort, I don't know if you have them where you are, where, where the name of the town is going all the way through the, the center of, of, the, of the candy, of the, of the stick of rock. And uh, if you break it in half, you've still got the name of that town, of that location, of that seaside uh, resort going all the way through the middle. And, and, and the way I see a, a, a core identity, if you could if you were to strip away all the, the business planning and the motivational statements and the mission statements and all the kind of stuff and just have your core identity, what it is that you bring to the table, what it is that your business brings to the table. That's what I mean by core identity. For me, it's, uh, it, it's this word passion, that's really it. And just looking back through my life, I, you know, whilst when I left college, I, I did work in a, in a bakery, that was my first job, and that's hard work. I worked in a factory, I worked in a wine shop, I've done some things, you know, I've got that portfolio career at the beginning of my kind of working life. Um, and the one thing they all had in common is that it was no reflection on the job or, the, or, or that business or profession. It, it was me, it just, there was nothing wrong with that. It was just that it wasn't my passion. They were not my passions. And I think my realization was that uh, I, I needed to sing. That's, that was my passion. I needed to communicate and I needed to be on stage. I needed to travel and meet lots of people. And, and so by doing that, by becoming a professional singer for all those years, I, 
uh, unconsciously, because I wasn't aware of all this at the time, lived my passion. And I think now that I'm a, a coach and I speak and I train and, and I'm still, I'm having a ball, it's great. I, I still, I'm in my flow, I'm still living my passion. Um, and I think, I don't know if you know my story, it's kind of, if you've heard me speak or you've read some of my blog posts, you'll know that until I was in my early 20s, I had a really, really bad stammer, a stutter, I couldn't say my name. It's a re it was a really, uh, it, it was a hard time. Now I can smile about it, I can look back and I can, I can be calm about it. At the time, it was a big challenge, it was a big, big challenge. So for me, communication is, uh, is a big deal. It's always been a big deal. It's still a big deal. How I work with companies, help them improve their presentation skills, their communication skills. Um, it's a, it's a, it's my purpose. Communication is my purpose. So the two words there: the passion, the purpose, and prosperity. Um, it's not for me. Prosperity is not about having loads of money. Uh, money. Uh, it, sure, it pays the bills, uh, it, it takes you on nice holidays, it, it gives you nice things, it can give you nice things. But for me, prosperity uh, is about living a prosperous life. It's about living uh, a life where you're generous. And I think that crystallized in my mind that, ah, oh, that's it, that's it. I have been living a, a rich life, I've been lucky enough to to live a rich life because I've been living my purpose and I've been doing things that I'm passionate about for, for so long now. I'm living a rich life. And so that's where those three words came from, passion, purpose and prosperity. So my challenge for you this week is to start thinking about what three words there might be for you. If you, if you want to leave a comment below, uh, if you want to list your some words below, uh, nice ones, you're very, very, uh, um, Welcome to do that and also if you're watching this video on anything uh, other than my website uh, please go to my website now it's mikeblissett.com forward slash free videos you'll see the email address on the bottom of the screen now please go there and subscribe and you get loads of uh, uh, tips and, and tools and, and uh, examples of how you can uh, build your business and market your business and just really have a ball doing it as well because I think that's what it's all about. So until next time, remember live with passion, purpose and prosperity. Speak soon. Bye-bye.